So hi there, this is the Rockwall Flat Mountain and basically there's three main types of climbing. Now you see all the tape on the wall, primarily people do bouldering and that's really just 15 feet high and you follow the marked routes on the wall. And it's the easiest to first get into because you don't need any equipment other than shoes and chalk which we always provide you down here. And uh, it's kind of like a group setting people hang out. A lot of first time climbers though like to do top roping which these are what the ropes are used for. One person, the climbers hook to the rope and climb up. On the other side, you'll be standing here belaying them. So pretty much you'll just be pulling the rope, the slack of the rope out and keeping them on lock as they climb up and get to the top. Whenever they're too scared or can't make it any higher, then they'll let go of the wall, you release them, you let the rope feed out. Finally, a little bit more advanced climbing, which you will probably eventually learn about, is uh, called lead climbing or sport climbing. That's actually when the rope's all on the ground and the climber climbs up and hooks himself up in the wall on the uh, metal anchor points. And it's kind of more of an advanced climbing thing and only a couple people do it, but it's really cool and you should get into it. So here we go, here's the control desk in all its glory. Pretty much when you first start, you'll be sitting here a lot and taking waivers. Anytime a first time climber comes down, they'll come to the desk first and they'll sign a waiver and that goes for each year. So what you do is a new climber comes down and you say hi there are you over 18 and if they are uh, you give them a waiver they pretty much fill out this name address easy details flip it over sign initial the back they can read it if they want and once you get this you take this and go file it in the cabinet and that's pretty much the main responsibility of the control desk out front so after you meet the climber at the control desk they're gonna need equipment all the shoes are located right here Whatever size they need, we have a giant variety of sizes, so you can just hand them that. Over here is all the different types of gear we use, whether it's for belaying, sport climbing, or elite climbing, or even ascending, which you'll get into later. It's all located right here. If someone wants to top rope, this is what they're gonna need to be wearing whilst they climb the wall. Depending on how large or small they are, we have different sizes for that also. You'll give them a harness, and uh, they'll put that on and be ready to go to the top. Chalk and tape and extra holds and bolts. All this is for basic wall maintenance. The tape we use for bouldering, the chalk we use to keep your hands from not sweating climbing, the holds we use to change up the wall so there's different scenery and on, on it every now and again. And of course the bolts are used to take off the holds and also put the holds back on. Any general information that you'll need is located on the wall. When the ropes are changed, the schedule, everyone's email address and phone number, and lastly and most importantly first aid is located right here in case someone gets a cut and if there's a more severe injury that happens, more technical first aid equipment over here. So I'm happy you enjoyed the tour of the rock wall and have a great day.